So what happens to carbohydrates when we eat them? So say you're eating an apple, it's mostly carbohydrate. You're gonna start chewing it. And in your mouth, there are actually enzymes or chemicals that help to start break down that apple. Your teeth also do a mechanical sort of breakdown of the apple. Then you swallow the apple and it goes down the esophagus, which is this tube here that connects your mouth to your stomach. And then your stomach is full of uh, acid that breaks down that apple even further into smaller bits. And then the final parts of digestion happen in the intestines. So first from the stomach, the apple will travel to the small intestine, which is these skinny tubes, where the carbohydrates are actually broken down into a sugar. A sugar is just a very small, it's the basic unit of a carbohydrate. And a carbohydrate is a bunch of sugar all sort of attached together. And so your intestine does the job of taking that carbohydrate, the apple, the piece of bread, that bowl of rice, and breaking it down into individual molecules of sugar. And the main sugar type that we get from carbohydrates is glucose. Okay, glucose is just one type of sugar. So we got our sugar from our carbohydrate. Now, this is where you have to sort of imagine um, what happens to, the, to, 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 to molecules in the body. So the glucose, so this is the sugar, is transported, literally, from the intestines, okay, where they're being digested, into the bloodstream. There's a network of, of, of blood vessels that are around the intestines and around every organ. And so it takes that sugar into the bloodstream and the bloodstream in your body, the, the arteries and the veins of your body carry the blood and they are like the highway for the body. Part of its job is to transport things like energy molecules like sugar to different parts of the body that need it. And every single cell in your body needs energy to work. And so, and glucose is one of the main energies, uh, uh, types of energy it uses to, to function, to, have, to be able to do its job. This is the part where it gets a little complicated. Okay, so you got the glucose. It's gone from your intestine. It went into the bloodstream. Your body wants to use it for energy. The pancreas's job is to sense that there's been a load of sugar delivered to the bloodstream. The pancreas can sense that, and its job is to make and release insulin in response to that influx of sugar.